Hi there, it's good to be here again on English Coach. I'm Simon and I'm here to talk to you today about thankfulness and gratitude. Now, it's put into three levels by a famous religious guy from medieval times. His name was Thomas Aquinas and he teaches the treaties of gratitude. And he says that gratitude comes in three levels. Those three levels are a superficial level, an intermediate level, and a deeper level. Now, when you put this into your day today, when you find an opportunity to say thank you for something that you've either received or been helped with uh, through the day, measure the amount of gratitude that goes into those things. So, for example, when somebody helps you, try to feel that exchange of gratitude. How, how intensely are you feeling when you give your thank you? Someone helps you in the supermarket or, or someone um, brings your mail to your door or anything that could be construed as helpful, useful, uh, caring, and in your favor. Uh, how, how are you demonstrating that? Uh, is it just a quick thanks? Is it a thank you because of this and because of that? Uh, is it something that you want to uh, reciprocate, perhaps? I think when we're talking on the deeper level of, of appreciation and, and gratitude, we're talking about reciprocating, but not reciprocating just because someone did something for you and you want to be even but because they have inspired you to feel good about what they did. And therefore, you also want to do something good. It's kind of uh, passing it on down to the next person. It doesn't need to go back to the same person. It could be that you received or were helped with something. And then you felt the need to do that for two or three other people. Uh, here's a little quote here. Appreciation can make a day even a life change. Your willingness to put it into words is all that's necessary. Now, this is something that Margaret Cousins uh, talks about. Uh, she, she, this is a quote from her. Uh, the first level of gratitude is the surface level. It is the level of recognition that someone has done something good for you. Um, of course, uh, it's an acknowledgement, right? The second level of gratitude is to praise give thanks so it's 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 taking it further than just acknowledging it it's showing our appreciation in word form that that person has done something okay the third degree according to thomas aquinas is the level of reciprocity the third deepest level of gratitude we find the level bound and feel com a commitment toward either giving back or helping back uh pledging uh our uh efforts to show how much that meant to us. Um, and what is the importance of this today? The importance is we have always lived in a reality where there has never been enough thanks. There has never been enough gratitude coming from people. People don't show their gratitude so often. Probably you kick yourself once a month or not exactly kick yourself, but you may, you may experience something like, Oh, I could have said thanks to that person, or I could have shown my appreciation of what they were trying to do for me, but, uh, I was busy or some other excuse, you know, uh, put it into practice. So even if it's just a quick thanks or if it's someone that you already have inside your friendship circle, your family circle, maybe you want to give them a, a, a big heartfelt hug if that is your personality type and really tell them how you feel about what they've done for you. Remember that showing gratitude does improve your approach to life. It does automatically make it easier for you to be positive, optimistic and effective in your day. 
promotes a lot of positive emotions, okay? So keep in mind, you have this ability to affect other people's lives. Do think about the impact that they're feeling when you're showing gratitude, that you did something uh, to acknowledge or, or totally appreciate or reciprocate that action that they did for you and therefore you participated in something extremely positive and either change that person's day or, or, or even change your own day. Okay, so keep all of this in mind and I look forward to seeing you again on the next English ch coach, not coach, but coach <laughs> uh, video. And, and I also like you to, uh, in the comment section, if you enjoyed this, write a little thank you note. Okay, show your appreciation. Thanks.